So this Elon Musk buying Twitter thing has become just an epic saga, hasn't it? It's just full of twists and turns and God knows how this is all going to end up. And as always, Elon Musk is doing his best to keep it entertaining. Here's the headline. Musk responds to Twitter legal battle by trolling the company with a meme. But first, just a quick recap. So Elon Musk notified Twitter that he is terminating the deal, the $44 billion deal. Uh, Musk's lawyer claimed that Twitter failed to comply with its obligations in the merger agreement. Mainly that uh, they weren't disclosing the information he needed to discover how many bot accounts were on Twitter. And obviously, the more bot accounts, the less that Twitter's worth. And then Twitter responded saying they're going to sue Elon Musk to force him to complete the $44 billion purchase. And they've hired an elite merger law firm. And then that leads us to Musk's response to this. <laughs> and let's take a peek. And here is Elon Musk's uh, tweet. They said I couldn't buy Twitter. Then they wouldn't disclose bot info. Now they want to force me to buy Twitter in court. Now they have to disclose bot info in court. <laughs> so, I mean, was he playing 4D chess the whole time? I really don't know. But, I mean, it's an amusing meme. So, I don't know. I mean, was this his plan? I don't know. Maybe. I mean, he's a pretty remarkable guy, isn't he? He's kind of a Howard Hughes figure before Howard Hughes became a hermit and grew his toenails out. But it says here in this article from the Daily Wire that Musk's legal team sent a letter to Twitter on Friday that stated Musk was terminating the purchase because, quote, Twitter is in material breach of multiple provisions of that agreement, appears to have made false and misleading representations upon which Mr. Musk relied when entering into the merger agreement, and is likely to suffer a company material adverse effect. So what is a uh, material adverse effect? It's a change in circumstances that significantly reduces the value of a company. Okay. So, and I guess going back to that meme that uh, Elon Musk has sent out, if it goes to court, then they're going to have to provide the information that would prove Musk's point. And that's where the uh, 4D chess would come in. And I think that you really can't dismiss anything out of hand when it comes to Musk. I mean, he's the guy who made electric cars popular and cool. And he's also building rockets, for God's sakes. So, you know, I don't discount anything out of hand when it comes to Musk. And he's obviously an extremely determined person who's incredibly driven to achieve his goals. And one of his goals was to turn Twitter into a free speech platform. He said back in April that he wanted to buy the platform because his strong intuitive sense is that having a public platform that is maximally trusted and broadly inclusive is extremely important to the future of civilization. And we know he cares about civilization because he's trying to personally repopulate it uh, with as many women as possible. But anyway, uh, regarding the financial aspect of acquiring the company, Musk said, I don't care about the economics at all. Well, I mean, I, I'm not sure that was entirely true, was it? <laughs> Seems like he does care about that a little bit. But anyway, he noted that um, one of his top priorities at Twitter would be eliminating the spam and scam bots and the bot armies on the platform. He said, it's important to the function of democracy. It's important to the function of the United States as a free country and many other countries and to help freedom in the world more broadly than in the U.S. As civilizational risk is decreased, the more we can increase the trust of Twitter as a public platform. And so I do think this will be somewhat painful. Well, he was right about that, wasn't he? So where all this will end up, I don't know. But uh, I will be paying attention and I will be making videos about it. Anyway, thanks a lot. Please subscribe, like, and share. Sharing really helps me out. That makes a huge difference. I notice when people share my content. Thank you for that. I'll see you next time.